Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Zork Sinan. Welcome to my channel. It is super awesome to see you here, everybody. <laughs> I don't want to say anymore. Okay, so I have a weird topic to talk about today. So, um, I've been thinking about this for about a couple of days just because it's kind of funny because it's like um, back when I was working, I went to all these types of concerts and stuff. And it's funny because like my, my friends... We're like, well, how come you didn't invite me to go to the concert? So I'm going to give a backstory before I go into that. So uh, back when um, all my friends were still here, because most of them have moved away because college, <laughs> they graduated and moved to different um, cities and different states. So anyway, um, we had this really good group of people that we went to on trivia night with. It was super fun. And we all had like our categories. So I was like pop culture and like um, music and stuff like that from like um, 2000s on, and just like general useless knowledge, easy. And then I had a friend that was um, science, I had one that was sports, and I had one for everything else. So we all have like our own little niche, and I uh, worked well in a trivia group. So anyway, um, we did this for about, I want to say like a year and a half, maybe two years. But um, I was always the coordinator for the group. I don't want to I had to call people and say, hey, do you want to do this or do you want to do that? And we were trying to do other stuff, but this never really turned out. We did Ultimate Frisbee a few times, and that was actually really fun. I really wish I could do that, but I don't have anyone in the general area that does that. So anyway, um, I digress from that. But anyway, so we were doing trivia and trying to do other stuff, and... I was always the coordinator, and it was really annoying just because when people were saying, like, well, who else is going? It's like, I don't know yet. People haven't texted me back yet or uh, messaged me on Facebook about it. So I would still get a, a decent number of people, but over the next, like, year and a half, it started dwindling and dwindling where I had to cancel a few times, and I got really mad about it. I legit went by myself one time just because, like, it's kind of depressing, like, I'm trying to make all these plans and stuff, and people don't want to come if other people are coming, or they won't come if other people won't come, or blah, blah, blah. It's really stupid annoying. If you want to go, say you're going. I mean, hello, it's not that hard. So anyway, back to um, the ticket thing. So back when I was working, I had money to, to go to concerts and stuff. I was just legit just buying myself a concert, uh, a concert ticket and go. No problem, better seats, no problem. So the next couple, and this was like probably the low point of the trivia thing where I would get maybe like really no one would go really. And so the same people would say like, well, how can you invite me to the concert? I would have loved to go. And I was like, well, I gave like the friend answers like, oh, I didn't really think about it. And I literally did this last minute and I just didn't think about it. But the truth is, if I can't get you to go to a freaking trivia night and I pay money for these tickets, like over, like over $150 for a ticket, and you don't show up, oh no. That's not going to fly. So if I, can't get, if I can't get someone to go to the beach, which is free, I'm driving... <laughs> And then I'm paying, like, then I'm going, inviting people to trivia and do other stuff, and y'all can't come and do that. Why in the world would I invite you to a concert? Literally, why would I bring you to a concert? So if you don't want to hang out with me because other people are not going to be there, I'm not going to invite you to a concert. I'm sorry. That's just not happening. So I just, then, um, after that and stuff, um, so it wasn't getting enough people to go to, um, do all the stuff. And I just literally stopped doing it. I literally texted with my friend and said, look, I'm not doing this anymore. I can't do it. If people are going to say, and that's another big issue that I have with people. When you say you're going to do something, you do it. Okay? And don't say like, oh, well, something last minute. No. No. I understand every once in a while, sure. But when you do it three or four times on a row, no. So if you say that you're going to do it all of a sudden, last minute, you say, oh, I can't do it. i got to go by. You know about it for, like, two, for about a week. You know your plan. You know if you're going to go or not. Understand, every once in a while, if you have something come up, that's great. 
That's fine. I understand that. But overall, it's silly. Just because a lot of people don't show up, it's not my problem. Because like, I make sure to be outgoing and be friendly and all this type of stuff. So, And I know these people like for years and stuff. And so I literally just stopped doing it. I was like, look, if y'all want to do it, that's great. I can't be coordinating this mess anymore. I got a bunch of other stuff happening. And it's when I was working literally 56 hours a week. I was making the time to do this, um, do this sacrifice my sleep for this because it always happened around 9 o'clock at night for trivia. I'm usually asleep by 8.45 at night. <laughs> so I'm driving all the way to town. It's about 30 minutes. Hanging out with people, that's like two hours. I get home literally around 11.30, 12 o'clock. I uh, am a wreck the next day at work because I, be, I had to be at work at 6 a.m. in the morning. Uh, no. So then I literally just stopped doing it. I was like, look, y'all can handle this. If y'all do it, that's great. But I'm not coordinating anything else anymore. And you know what? They hadn't, I don't think anyone's even had any trivia whatsoever because... Um, some people got to have finals come up, and then that's pretty much like a wash. Like, after that, they kind of get set in the way. It's like, oh, well, if they're not doing it, what's the point of doing it then? So, you know, and then people moved. They graduated. So I understand that. And it's, it's kind of disappointing that I don't see those people much anymore. But, I mean, I was working 56 hours a week for almost three years in a row. We had occasional breaks, but not really. So my social life went to crap. So... But anyway, um, now that I'm not working, I'm trying to build it back up a little bit, but I'm not really trying that hard. Because, honestly, I'm an introvert, and I kind of like to really be by myself a little bit. And it's refreshing that I don't have to worry about people. And that's the main point I'm trying to... <laughs> I don't know, this is just literally a rant. <laughs> but I feel like it's kind of valid, because when... It's like what coordinator people go through, people... Constantly don't show up. They constantly forget. They constantly don't want to go because someone else is going or they're not going, so they won't show up either. And it's really annoying because you gotta have that one person that connects to everybody to show up. It's also like you gotta bribe them with money. It's like I need you to come now so these other people will come. So I just find that kind of annoying. But anyway, that's gonna do it for me. So if you like this video, please give it a like, comment down below. Do you do you feel my pain? <laughs> with this because it's really frustrating really 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 frustrating and then just subscribe for more stuff and I'll post more <laughs> I'm trying I'm actually I'm trying to post more I, I'm trying to do like, like a video like this and then do like a lip sync or dust smash um, in the same week that's my goal for now on so anyway I guess if you like this like comment subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye everybody